Hi everyone, I want to make a video to Jehovah's Witnesses and I don't know how you will react but um, I have been thinking about this for a while now Uh, I have been thinking about this for the several months now and uh, I can just say that uh, I have seen documentaries about uh, uh, the Holocaust of the Second World War and uh, I can say that Hitler he wanted to eliminate the Jews and that is actually a genocide and the God of Jehovah's Witnesses uh, is even worse than Hitler because he wants, I mean, Jehovah's Witnesses believe that Yahweh from the Bible or Jehovah uh, will eliminate all the people in this world. Just, uh, I mean, this is so stupid. Uh, because that mindset is like the terrorist because they just want to eliminate every single one who isn't a match as Jehovah's Witnesses and some people are looking forward to Armageddon and when I think about the Holocaust uh, Germans they were so desperate after the first world war because uh, they were actually in the ruins. ruins. They, the city was playing with money because their money, their currency were worthless. And Hitler, I have heard some of his uh, talks and speeches and he wasn't that talented. He just said everything what they wanted to hear because Germans, they were so desperate because they were literally in ruins. And when I think about it, it is so depressing because he did make Germany better. He did, I mean, I don't like him at all. But uh, Germany got a little bit better because of Hitler and uh, the Nazis. They created uh, freeways, but they needed it because Hitler had other plans. Like the freeways were actually for tanks and uh, the military vehicles. But anyway, um, when I. I mean, I saw a documentary about Auschwitz and the documentary is Auschwitz, the factory of death. And when I saw the documentary, I saw images, uh, I saw pictures that no one should ever see. And, uh, and I can tell you that I saw the bodies of people and that made me very I mean it is traumatizing to see a dead body and I can say I can tell you that because I have an experience I have seen a, a person who passed away that and that is one of the most terrible things I have been through Actually, it isn't the worst thing I have been for to see the person who passed away. And the Watchtower organization, they are actually teaching yeah, who was witnesses that when Armageddon comes, all people who aren't yeah, was witnesses are going to pass away. And uh, I have heard that ex-witnesses have heard 
that uh, Watch Tower teaches that uh, when they pass away, the worldly people uh, are going to be, when well, their bodies will be everywhere. And I really hope that this video doesn't get demonetized. But, uh, okay, poor girl. But this is so difficult to talk about. But but the God of Jehovah's Witnesses is evil. The God from the Bible is evil. It is actually a psychopath. And I don't know how Jehovah's Witnesses can, uh, can, uh, I don't say that every Jehovah's Witnesses look uh, forward to Armageddon, but the Witnesses that are looking forward to Armageddon, they need a reality check because every single human being deserve a fair chance and you can't judge older people just because they're not from your religion I mean just think about Hitler and the Nazis they were national socialistic uh, socialist um, socialist nationalist anyway um, they, they, they found an, they found escape notes they use, and they wanted to eliminate them, but all Germans had no idea about the concentration camps. Um, the Nazis produced false propaganda. They were hiding the truth of the the Holocaust, but some Germans, especially the Nazis, they knew what was going on behind the closed door, closed doors, and that is so terrible because uh, this is so difficult to talk about. And because I was a part of uh, the religion when I was a kid. And that was always weird to me that uh, Jehovah was a loving God. And that he was going to eliminate all people that aren't Jehovah's Witnesses. And, and I was like, why wouldn't I... Why, why would a loving God do something like that? That is just evil. And I can't be a part of that. But I went to the Kingdom Hall because of my friends. And because they were actually our friends when we were uh, small kids, small children. But now I realize how um, how conditional their love is. It's not authentic love. But every single human being are equals at birth because every single one is worth the same. But uh, when I think about life itself, when they get older, when people get older, they make decisions. And when they are evil and bad people, they are worth less than all other people. Because I did mention Anders B. M. Reivik, Larry Nasser, uh, and um, Josef Christen. These three men are just evil because the things of the 
because the things they did. And uh, if you want, if you don't know about Ernst Mayhem Gravik, he is a Nazi from Norway and he did in uh, July 2022, uh, 2011, he did create a homemade explosion in Oslo. He put it in uh, the government building of Oslo. It exploded and he, he was very methodical. He he did um, he did actually think this through because he was just uh, um, planning this because the police officer officers they were having their holidays during these days and then he did drive to a small island Utøya, and there were a couple of teenagers in a camp they were camping and they belonged to the left party and he was dressed as a police officer and he was just um, luring them, not luring them, but he was, uh, um, well, he was just uh, lying to them that he was saying, uh, while he was saying that he was a police officer, he was shooting all of the people that he could uh, murder. And he did manage to murder 69 people in Utøya and 8 people in Oslo so the explosion in Oslo was just a decoy and not an ambush but a decoy a distraction because the real plan was to be in Utøya and cause that uh, massacre but the thing what Anders Bering Breivik did, the thing what he did, I mean, that's not even, I mean, that's nothing compared to Eva's Witnesses and Armageddon. And the people who are worldly, worldly people, their children who organ who doesn't know anything about the was witnesses the children who organ born or who are still at the belly how will they be i mean they won't be resurrected and even i mean if we say that the resurrect resurrection is going to happen over 100 billion people will be resurrected and they will live for a thousand years here in this world and they will talk about the bible and if they don't believe in the bible they will be murdered again by satan and i mean all of this is so messed up and I believed in this when I was a kid. And children, they are so innocent. And this mentality, the Watch Towers teaching has messed me up. And I don't want to talk about this anymore. Um, I'm going to cut the video right here and right now. But, uh, I hope that people can be more open-minded and I truly hope that people are happy. So